I just scraped this from Cell's databanks. Looks like we just broke out their biggest secret. That creature was the source of Cell's energy. The Alpha Seth. He's way more powerful than I expected. When I was near him, I saw things the Seth didn't want me to see. If they can get into my head, maybe I can get into theirs and find a weakness. Psycho, you know of a suit cradle nearby? Yeah. At the skinny lab where Cell held me. Let's link up there in 30 mics. Be careful in there, Michael. There are some things you can never forgive. We just deployed in the swamp. Affirmative, moving to sector. All quiet. You hear that? Yeah. All clear over here. False alarm. Understood. Resume perimeter sweep. No visible target. Moving to next checkpoint. Something there? Must be nothing. Blacktail Actual, this is Blacktail Niner. Delancey 4 Alpha is clear. Moving to the next squadron, over. Negative, Blacktail Niner. Condition Red Star Rising has been initiated huh? by Nax. Over. Red Star Rising, please confirm that this is not a mistake. Over. Confirmed. Red Star Rising has been set. Over. No, shit, shit, shit. What are they thinking? Red Star Rising? What's wrong with them? I don't know. Screw Prophet. Let's get out of here. Hey! What about Steber? Fuck him, he'll catch up! You heard of this Red Star Rising, Psycho? No, never. So don't spook easily. Find Good out man. what you can. We'll meet up at the rendezvous. This is a complete mess. Rash and Claire are offline. You need to solo this while I figure out what's going on. Use EMP! Visual. Let's 
Joe! He's out there somewhere. You can't hide forever, Prophet! We'll fight you! He's not here! Got word of an iron horse to save me near your location. Those are their intel runners. Must be oh. their dirty secrets to the shredder. Prophet, if you can get eyes on that intel, might be able to find out who talks to you. Prophet is here! Uh. Ah. Point of contact. I've located Iron Horse. What's going on here? Brilliant. Look for the skinning lab file. What's going on here? Stand down. It's nothing.
want all eyes on that golden circle. You spot anything moving, you blow it the fuck apart. No mercy. Check, radio check, profit. You there? Comms were down. EM pulse just knocked out the network. Rash is a wall. I must make him our highest priority, but Michael has your brief. Heads up, Prophet. Cell records tell me there's a Ceph mind carrier near your location. With your sensitivity to the alien influence, you might want to swing wide. Negative. The Ceph have one collective intelligence, a hive mind, and it's all dependent on the Alpha. Now he's free. They're all waking up. 
These mind carriers are part of that process. I need to get eyes on. A hive mind? But you have a lot of alien material in your DNA. I don't know if any of this is a good idea. Checking in. ETA at rendezvous about 30 mics.
assemble at towers 419 and 426. Sign of rash. I'm getting reports of CEP activity all over the dome. Cell are being annihilated. Network is nearly back online, but our field commanders are reporting revived Ceph everywhere. The dome perimeter hasn't been breached, but inside... My god. They're exterminating everything human. I need to find Rash. I'm... I'm not trained for anything like this! Prophet, heads up. There's a disabled pinger close to your location. With all this Ceph activity, it might become operable again. Think you should steer clear? Maybe, but if it has a power source, I might be able to make use of it.
bridge to access the walkway. I'll bring the lift down when you make it. The access panel is on the opposite side of the tower to the bridge. Listen, there's not a single day goes by where I don't wish I was you. Even with all that God knows what hardware, wetware, Ceph mutation bullshit going on under that skin of yours, I'd take it. Come on. just a matter of time before they put me into one of these things. Because that's what the nano suit is, right? Instead of exoskeleton. I'm gonna make you fucking pay! You bastards! Where the fuck are you? Psycho. If I could find the cell bastard who did this, I'd fucking kill him. Come on. This is it. Claire, open the door. Hold on. You 
in? Yep. Halfways. Calibrating sensor remotes. Just like the lake. Compensating. We're in. Locked. Have a seat, mate. to be sure about this. Unlocking the suit means breaking the safety seals, rerouting the nanites. If he's infused with Ceph technology now, there's no telling what he'll become. You can handle this, right boss? Do it. I'm accessing the memory retrieval systems. Filter in. Blockers are cleared. I'm registering critical neurological changes. You should be able to make a clear link with the Ceph now. What's this? Michael, you shouldn't. Don't. Why not? It won't help. Operation? The nanosuit is then fully removed. Subject 8A, Sergeant Michael Seitz, is... Uh, He's still functioning at near optimal levels, but accelerated degradation is to be expected. You... You did this to me. Michael, please listen to me. You are the reason why. I, I mean, I fight Cell because of you, because... Is that why you cared? Or were you pretending to care because of this? Because of your own fucking guilt? I didn't have a choice, Michael! The cell program, we were in debt, you know how this works. I was forced to do this. To all of those people. I had to listen to their screams day after day after day. I know what I did. Jesus, believe me, I know. And I'll have to carry that with me as long as I live. Every day of my life. Michael! And feeling bad about it makes it all right, does it? If you're so fucking sorry, Claire, how come I had to find out like this? Why didn't you just come clean, you lying Michael, fuck? Michael, listen to me. You know how it works. You know she didn't have a choice. She did what she had to do. No choice. Just doing what she's told. Just following orders. Who the fuck does that sound like, Prophet? I'll tell you one thing, though. She was right about you. You might as well be a fucking machine because you sure as hell ain't no human being anymore. I mean, you never were much good at it to begin with, but Jesus Christ, look at you now! Whose face are you wearing under that helmet these days, Prophet? Do you even have a face anymore? We all had to make sacrifices. You had a choice, mate. Everyone has a choice. Look, I told you. Everything you needed to know. Remember these. All the men who died under your command because you were just following orders. Because you had no choice. Just like her. Psycho. No, mate. You take that suit of yours. And you go fight your own battles. Like always. Mike! Wait. No, Claire. He's right. Let him go. <laughs> <laughs> 